too feel that way? Huh? Oh, me? Oh, yeah, sure. What's she doing? See, I just read all your... Yeah, I just read all your... Yeah, I just read... Can you fly that thing? Not yet. Thank you. Not only know her history. The last 5,000 years... We've been through 2,500 years that she's missed. ...of phonetic literacy. Only to encounter the end of the road. Right now, the people in this room are making the decision whether or not we're going to have any more literacy or any more civilization in the 20th century or whether it's going to stop right here. One of the strangest implications of the phonetic alphabet is private identity. Before literacy, before phonetic literacy, there had been no private identity. There had only been the tribal group. Homer knows nothing about private identity. Homer's world of the acoustic epic, the tribal encyclopedia of memorized wisdom, which Eric Havelock has reported so ably in his preface to Plato. The Homeric epics were part of this acoustic wisdom that preceded literacy and which were phased out by literacy. Homer was wiped off by literacy. Homer had been the educational establishment of the Greeks for centuries. An educated Greek was one who had memorized Homer, who could sing it to his guitar or harp and perform it in public. He was a gentleman and a free 